let's experiment a little bit with circuits. As we discussed, electricity will only flow on a closed circuit such as the one shown on the screen. Notice that the electrons flow through the wire and each of the bulbs before they return to the battery. If one of the wires breaks, a gap occurs in the circuit and all the lights go out. When lights are lined up one after the other on a circuit like these lights are, it is called a series circuit. The problem with a series circuit is that when one light burns out and its filament breaks, it creates a gap in the circuit. All the lights go out because electricity won't be able to flow to the other bulbs. This problem can be solved with a parallel circuit. In a parallel circuit, the wires that are connected to light bulbs run parallel to each other rather than having all the bulbs in a row. This means that one light can burn out or be removed and the other lights on the circuit will stay lighted. For example, if we remove the light that is closest to the battery, the other two lights don't go out because each light is connected in a way that the electrons have a complete path to travel to the positive side of the D-cell battery. Now let's practice what we've discussed about circuits with an activity.